Yeah. Hi, I'm Shanti Elliott. I'm a 19 year old singer songwriter. I'm going to be performing my own song called Perfectly Imperfect on the Soapbox Live Lounge today. Can you tell us a little bit about how you came to write the song? So I wrote this song like three months ago and I was kind of in like a really bad place because um, like I just felt a bit like out of place like with friendships, like relationships, that kind of thing. And um, like I wanted to write something because I couldn't like verbally get it out, like just speaking to someone. And I wanted to kind of write something and um, I put on a tight beat and I just literally freestyled to it and kind of like just filled in the gaps and that made it all make kind of sense and yeah that's how I kind of wrote the song. I'm not begging you, begging you, you push away to you. It's also great to have one of South School students here. How are you finding it? So, well, I've been here for like two years already and it's like it's been so great. Like I've learned so much um, at South School. Um, I've been doing like a lot of like development for my performance because I used to be really like a shy, introverted person and now like I'm just not like performing like second nature to me now. So like I've learned so much here, I love it. Is there anything in the future that people should look out for? Well, I'm planning on releasing like an EP in October, but before that, I'm going to be releasing some singles. So definitely look out for um, like two or three singles, maybe like August time. So. Um, and how has it helped you develop your sound um, and what have you learned to like combine those like genres that you like? So like before coming to sound school like I didn't know like what I wanted to do, like, what, like, what I wanted to sing. I was raised on like all kinds of music like garage, funk, like reggae, R&B so like I was just really confused. I was just trying to find myself, find my sound and now like, like being at sound school I've had like one-to-ones, like a lot of one-to-ones with like my um, vocal coach Lisa and like a um, teacher that was here before called Simone and Monica and they would always like tell me like sing songs that would like project my voice more and kind of like made me like cry so then I can kind of get into the mode and now it's like I like, like even the way I dress like I dress really like kind of like retro like maybe like you would say so like I want to do like become like a R&B neo soul kind of artist yeah take time for yourself cause that's what you wanted to do anyways I 
have never been the 